I wanted to take just a couple minutes to show you a few tricks with your smartphone. That's what this whole thing's all about anyway. So first of all, welcome. I am so glad you're here with me. And <clears throat> let's get started on just a little bit of trivia today, just to show you what it's going to be like when you get each one of the lessons. Okay, so let's get started. First of all, let's show you the screen of my iPhone XR. Okay, it's very much like the iPhone 11 with uh, the 11 has a few real nice enhancements for the camera. Uh, but the apps are the same. You say, well, wait a minute, I have an iPhone 6 or a 7, an 8, uh, or, or the 10. What do I do? The apps are just about the same on all of them. You say, well, what's the difference? Well, the quality, the speed, things along that line. Oh, see, now that is my cat. And he's hanging out, and uh, it just went blank. So now I'm going to touch it, and here he is back. Now, if I swipe up from the bottom, face ID, face ID, not going to do it because I'm on too many devices here. So I will put in my code, and we'll get it back. Now, what I wanted to show you very quickly today is that uh, clock. See the time? That's the actual time. See up here in the corner, it's 142. And there it is, 142. Now, if you click on it, hit the clock. And uh, if you notice all the way at the bottom on the right, it's a timer. Now we tap the next one. It's now a stopwatch. Click the next one. And it has alarms. These are alarms that I have set up that I use every so often. So I just keep them in there. And then world clock. This shows you what time it is locally. So I live in Laurel, Maryland. So Baltimore time would be the closest to that. So we have Indianapolis, we have Phoenix, we have Honolulu, we have Munich, we have London, and we have Los Angeles. Why those? Those are the ones that I set up. Can you set up more? Sure you can, okay? To match where in the world you want to know what time it is. Like, for instance, I have friends in Hawaii, okay? Right now, if you look at Baltimore in military time, it's 1.44 in the afternoon. But in Hawaii, if you look down in Honolulu, it is 7.44. You say, well, wait a minute. He lives on a different island all of the Hawaiian islands or counties as they are, each one of the islands is a county and all of the counties have the same time. So when you say Honolulu, you're also talking about the big island. You're talking about Maui, which is where my friends are. Okay. So, <clears throat> you know, it's 744 in the morning. Do you want to talk to them then that early? Maybe they're just waking up. So you need to wait for a while before you try to converse with them. That's where this app comes in very, very handy. So we're going to swipe up again. And what I want to show you next is a thing in notes. Well, it doesn't have to be notes, but I'm going to use notes because I'm going to put in a note. And so here we go. The very top line is the heading. Okay, and then when you hit return, it moves down into the screen where the type style is much smaller automatically. So now with notes, I'm going to say this is a test. Did you notice down at the bottom what I'm doing? I'm just sliding my finger along and it is projecting what the word is that I want to spell. See? That I want to spell. How about that? Pretty cool. But you don't have to do that. 
you can just do it the old fashioned way. This is a, say you wanted to go back and say, this is a great test. Well, how do you get up there? Well, here's the thing. Push and hold down on the space bar and everything disappears. But it also is where you can move the cursor anywhere you want to. This is a, and I'm going to stop right there and say, great test. Hold the space bar down again. Everything down at the bottom is going to disappear. So you know you can move it now and then just move it out of the way. And there you have it. So that's how you can move that cursor around anytime you want to. So with that, we're going to end this. But this is the kind of thing we're going to be showing you. Little tips and tricks that maybe you didn't know. Maybe you don't care. <laughs> but if you do care, learn about your smartphone with me. I just came back on to say thank you for joining. And I look forward to sharing new tips and tricks with you right into your emails. That's all you have to do. Or you can go to the website too, if you like. GoldenAgerTechieTraining.com What is it? Let me show you. Uh, da -da -da -da. See if I can get it. There we go. Golden Ager Techie techietraining.com okay so it's a little hard to see with my big self in front of it <clears throat> but uh, you get the idea so with that we're back to our other display and it's time to say goodbye hey it was great have a good day